We want to show you a live picture now right outside of Smith's Mortuary where the procession for Deputy Greg McCowan, the deputy who died in the line of duty after a shooting last night during a traffic stop, is reaching. Now, it is actually passing by the hearse that Deputy Greg McCowan is in. It's passing by the Blunt County Justice Center right now. We just saw that go by on Lamar Alexander Parkway as that procession reaches Smith's Mortuary, which is their destination for the end of this procession. Certainly a somber procession, and you can probably see from the live footage that traffic on the other side. Everyone is paused. People standing along the side of the road, they are paused, showing respect to this fallen deputy who is making his way to Smith's Mortuary right now. Meanwhile, right here at the Justice Center all day long, folks have been stopping by to leave memorials, tributes, flowers to place on the hood of the deputy cruiser just to show their respect and doing all of this on a terribly gloomy day. Many people have brought umbrellas with them so that they can make sure to stand outside. Some people made sure to just pull up and park their cars and get out so that they could stand along the side of the road and show their respect. And we can still see plenty of law enforcement vehicles and cruisers passing by the Justice Center right now with their lights on. This all is, I don't know if you can tell, as it starts to rain pretty heavily here in Maryville for this procession. It is certainly setting the tone for a very somber day here in East Tennessee and in that procession Deputy McCowan's brothers and sisters in blue are joining him as he makes his final trip to Smith's Mortuary here in Blunt County. They have their lights going now and it has to just be a very hard moment for them as well. Absolutely.